Hello darlings, this is Chetna Spruti and I did my 30 days of one meal a day. I'm currently doing 90 days of one meal a day challenge in that 30 days are done. So one third of the challenge is done. First few days, it was hard. Like this is not my first rodeo. Like I have done intermittent fasting. I have done one meal a day. So I have done alternate day fasting, but I gave it a break for like six months because of my spine surgery, recovery and everything. So now I'm back on track. Even though I'm familiar with the fasting and everything, first few days felt hard, <laughs> a little hard. So I took support from black coffee, decaf coffee, green teas, black teas and everything. First few days the weight went down and it was stagnant and after some more days it went down and stagnant. I'm like, what is the point of it? But I don't want to keep it a suspense because I post every day, shots every day, I update my weight every three days so it's no secret so i have lost eight pounds that is 3.6 kgs i started around 186.5 pounds on august 10th 186.5 pounds on september 10th um, 178.5 pounds i lost around eight lbs that in cages is 3.6 kgs so whenever i see cages and whenever I see eight pounds I'm like what is the point of it in 30 days 26 were successful fast like I only ate one meal a day in 26 days next four of days two were like pujas occasions where I was taking prasad and everything and the two was like one day I forgot to take my medications I had to eat again and then the day was like eff it shit this is not happening why is my weight not moving like why is the scale like this stagnant i know it's eight lbs of loss i should be happy but like seeing everyone partying having fun eating food i'm like why like i'm giving so much into it but why is this not happening to me why am i stagnant like for 10 days there is nothing the scale was going plus one pounds and staying same and it's not even coming down to let's say oh yeah it came to 178 176 no it was 178.5 pounds if i look at it more often it was going 180 and i'm like dude what is happening so anyways i look back at my journey where i started at 220 pounds and i'm like there is point to it. Uh, there is this quote I'm reading from my, it's a slow process, but quitting won't speed it up. So I kept reminding myself, like I came from 220 pounds to 180 pounds. So it is gonna happen one step at a time, but if it is happening slowly, uh, it's okay, it's going. And not only just losing weight, what did I gain from doing one meal a day? I remembered that hot flushes i'm just 34 i i used to get hot flushes where like suddenly it would be like uh, the skin is getting prickled and I, I would feel so hot i would sweat a little it's all blessing of pcos i know hormone imbalance and my periods are regular so that's a win and i'm active you know like i be, uh, these puja days are going where ganesh chaturthi is happening birthday parties are happening we are going out to restaurants and everything like still even with all this happening if i had my meal like i'm active and i'm not tempted to eat another meal because i kept reminding myself this is these are the benefits i'm going to reap i'm not going to stray away from my path i already lost 40 pounds i have to go further and there is good amount of journey ahead and this is going to be a lifestyle thing so not only losing eight pounds i also lost energy crashes so like i used to at the afternoon in the evening i used to feel so down i'm like i need to eat something to get the energy up that feeling was there for so many years like i had to constantly get something into my system to operate that felt like that without this food like i this evening won't pass that was a feeling but that was gone i'm active i feel lighter skin became clearer and i sleep like a log watch the phone forever keep on scrolling keep on scrolling like oh i'll sleep at 10 i'll sleep at 11 do that around figure i'll sleep at 12 all these things of scrolling and everything maybe because having a good day 
like having empty stomach and lighter and all these things are helping i guess i'm sleeping better the food started um first few days the food was like anything left over from here and there like what i packed for my husband what i packed for my kid like leftovers yeah i'm taking that i'm staying away from rice but eating those meals but eventually like i'm taking my i'm giving myself time and preparing some food with good amount of fiber in it a good amount of curry in it and protein in it and complex carbs like quinoa millets or something in it so i started putting together meals still one of the things is snacks i just love snacks like people love desserts i love snacks i eat it after just eating my meal but i'm like some days there were days where i was eating more than necessary i'm trying to tone it down so 30 days are done adlbs are lost i'm like okay i ate good amount of carbs in this next time i want to concentrate more on uh, like now i got used with the journey and i can stay on one meal a day and function properly and happily <laughs> so i'm i wanted to concentrate on low carb meals so next month i'm i'm i wanted to do low carb meals and see how it feels from eating anything everything whatever is available to eating low carbs how does it feel so i want to see this experiment and i'll keep you posted another day if you're considering fasting and you want to know why to fast, what are the uses, click this video. I don't know which side, so click this video. And if you're fasting and getting distracted and want to break that fast, getting tempted to break that fast, check out these diversion techniques. These will be helpful. These are from experience and going through good amount of fasting, uh, serving those fasting days and coming to a point where enjoying the fasting. So these techniques help, so do check them out. I'll post what meals I ate and I post what are the pictures like from day one to day 30. I'm active on Insta, I'm active on YouTube. I'm posting shots every day of what I'm eating, how the day is going and everything. If you came to this point and if you haven't subscribed, please do subscribe. Those are short videos, 30 seconds, but you will you will know how the day feels and you'll get ideas of what to eat and everything and we can be fasting buddies bye not only just losing eight pounds i have one pound size down i went from double xl to xl shirts feel a little looser at this area and we feel very very little at the chest area i i have a peer shaped body so i carry most of my weight in the chest and also in the tummy area so happy fasting and happy healing Fasting changes lives. It has changed mine. And if you're considering fasting, if you're considering one meal a day, let me be your buddy. See, ask questions, share your experience, anything. I'm there for you. Thank you so much, guys. Love you. Bye.